in this video, I'm going to show you how to install Pullid in Comfy UI from scratch and remove any errors that are there in Pullid. The X DXL variant. So before starting the video, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. So what the full video to install Pullid and remove any errors that you have. So the first thing is we go to Comfua Windows Portable, then open Python embedded, then type CMD over there. So first we have to know what Python version you are on. This is the most important step. Avo type Python in Python embedded, type Python dot exe slash slash version. So this is the Python version. I have the 3.12.7. You just need to remember 3.12 if you have the same thing. So now go to the GitHub site and download this Pulid Prete model. And after downloading this, we have to put it in the Pulid file. I'll show you how. So I have downloaded this one. So I'll take that one. So now go to Comfiva then modems, then go to pull it. If you don't have pull it, then just like click over your new folder and type the exact spelling that I have done in all lower cases, pull it like this and just paste it over you. Then now let's go to the GitHub page. Now the Eva clip, this will be automatically downloaded from hugging phase when you start the comfy UI or do anything, apply any workflow. For now this, the face lip depends on the dependency. We'll do it that later. Click on the antelope to, to file over there, then download the zip, the pickle version. Just copy this and go to go to models then inside face then go on models in inside the inside face then paste the zip file over there then unzip it and everything else you'll get this file just copy all this or don't copy this just delete the zip file and Keep the normal file. Now let's start the config. Huh? Go to Questrom Nodes Manager. Then over here, search Pulid. F download the first one. The second one is the Flux one. If you want the Flux one, Flux with you, how to download Flux Pulid, then comment down below. I make that as well. So after this, Everything will download like this. <laughs> Refresh. It's not over yet. Uh, we have to do much more things than pull it. Now we're just installing the pull it. While this is happening, uh, just please like, share and comment on this video. And share the video with your friend as well. So now, Everything is up. Okay. Now, I'm giving you a file below. Just, oh, not a file, but a link in the description. Open that. There's some file over there. This file. Or just open, the, or just type the inside page 07. Then everything will come. If you remember, we started the video with checking the Python version. This is the Python version. You, uh, I had the 3.12. So download this if you have the same as mine. Or if you are 3.12, just download that. Everything is the same. Do, j then copy the file. Who were you? This is one of the main steps. Just copy the file over there and over here. Yeah. Then go back. 
now we'll open the cmd file over here cmd and just type python.exe and pip and everything installed there like the exact name as the file otherwise it won't work i have downloaded already that's why it's typing requirement already satisfied but for you guys it will download some files it will take around five to ten minutes or maybe less after that uh, open the description of the video then go to the link that i've provided then copy this file python exe everything copy it now go to uh, what i don't know windows portable mm, i'm sorry it lacked a bit but now go to python embedded type cmd over here now copy paste all the three to four files that i've given i have already downloaded it that's why i require right satisfied it's it's telling me there are four files one i don't now do the same thing again so you guys get what i'm trying to say so i'll fast forward the video no in starting gnome fee you'll get this red arrow don't worry uh, i don't know what this is but it's still working now let's open python no sorry uh -huh. come for what now let's test if it's working now i'll go to examples oh yes examples this is the workflow basic workflow and just downloading this to show you guys that it's working pull it now so let me open the workload that i downloaded this so now you can see pull it is there so we have in completely installed pull it successfully now the load pull it model you have to download this file <laughs> this file won't be downloaded for you i'll give the link in the description like see oh you load put a model that this file over here 791 and me just download it and mm -hmm. i tell you as where to put the load portal model uh -huh. go to come for you eh? open home for you eh? then go to models then go to pullard just press the follow away oh this is it <laughs> now i don't know what the key sample everything are but just let's try if it's working or not Oh, I take this fire wheel. This is the model that I've created from Comfy and only. So let's take that. Uh, I don't know the key sample everything, but just let's try something out and see if it's working or not. So this is the command prompt. I've left all the positive and negative uh, as the same. Mm, the photo is a bit weird because the case and the setting is not right, but it's working. That's all we want. This is not a workflow. This is just how to install pull it. So let's try another thing. Let's change the schedule to normally. So this is the photo. Looks pretty decent. Uh, this was a caris. The normally one was not that good, 
So I skipped it. So let's try. Now I'll change the prompt. Now I've written a young girl drinking coffee in a coffee shop. So this was the prompt or photo that I got. Pretty decent for a basic workflow. I don't know. Yeah. Okay, so let's finish the video like you. So if you like the video, then please do like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys for watching. And please let me know if you want any other videos like this. If you want to see Pulled Flux version, how to download that.